damage from the storm certainly dimmed the hopes of farmers heading into harvest season. One Melba farmer's crop is almost a total loss. Reporter Eric Fink joins us live in the studio with the story. Yeah, Roland, Steve Martino says he prayed for rain to drop on his crops all summer long. But Thursday's storm combined with hail was too much, and now he plans to work hours a day to salvage what he can. Eddie Martino has worked on the family farm for 20 years. He spent this afternoon clearing away a heavy dose of mud underneath his livelihood. In, in 20 minutes, it's, it's all wiped out. Thursday's storm ripped through this land and left a huge imprint on the upcoming season. This bean field leveled. Last night, it was saturated with water, compromising the health of this crop and dampening the mood for Eddie and his father, Steve. To lose the water on the 5th of September, we were coming out pretty good. And we was feeling good about that. And then to have this hit yesterday and ruin the co crop we've worked on all summer. It looked like a really good crop for as hot as it was all year. Our bean crop, we thought, was as good as we've ever had. Two and a half inches of rain in two hours and a pretty severe hailstorm. And this bean crop right here that was a week away from getting harvested is now covered in mud. The Martinos say there's nothing they can do when Mother Nature decides to descend on their fields. Now they'll spend the first part of the harvest doing their best to ensure at least a portion of their beans, corn, and sugar beets can be revived. It definitely is going to take a few more trips over the fields that, that we weren't expecting to make. The profitability is probably out of this crop this year. I'm hoping to break even. I would, I would say it's going to be real tough. This father and son say the only good thing to come out of the storm, they have crop insurance. You know, Steve's worked on the same 1,300 acres of land since 1969. He says yesterday's storm did the most damage in nearly four and a half decades. Live tonight, Eric Fink, Fox 9 on your side. And more personal damage, lightning from the storm.